Welcome to the Osis Cafe, our rest for the wicked. For you more work, help us make mercury. We need lots of lots and lots of things to drink. Like water and juice. Tea make and all that. Mercury should be plump and juicy, yes? Like peeled grapes, mmm. What skin tastes weird? And you off to Earth. See you later. Ah, that once again I cut off my head with the curtain. And I'm puking words. Letters and words and hearts. I like, I feel like freaking shoot him up, boss. Alrighty, time to roll. We're in a candy store. Love mom and pop places. They're yummy and cheap. Are you going to eat that? Because if you aren't... Oh yes, the calamari. If you're all this big in this much time, then it's a juicy job. Roll up lots of drinks, please. Okay, okay, hello, hello. Wow, we candy corn. We're not speaking to you. And even more weird music, which is a bit too weird for me. I mean, like, when I'm listening to music, there is always a limit for the weirdness which I can listen to. Wow, it's a friggin' sushi man. And it's looking at me. Ah, it looks like it's freaking Cthulhu. So oh, I'm gonna roll up that punk ass guy later. I mean, like, honestly, this this music is way too weird for me. As I mentioned before, some people might like it. I will judge you, but hell, it just ain't doing it for me. I mean, like, this guy should have even put this kind of weird music though up, because this game was, is already so weird that it doesn't need weird music to even further express the weirdness that is in this game. Since this game is so weird that it's like one of the weirdest games ever in the current generation of gaming. Since uh, always on the Nintendo Entertainment System, NES for short, there is a, a lot weirder games there which I'm gonna go to. And also the porn games on Atari, oh those things. Yeah, those games were probably the most weirdest games ever. Not to say I've ever played them. I've only seen gameplay of them. I'm not that perverted to go out of oh I'm gonna go play freaking Atari 20 2600 just because I wanna see freaking pixelated pornography. That's just weird. Who would want to make games like that? Okay, now we're getting off topic. Well, going off topic is good, because this game is already so weird, it's almost self-explanatory. It's a friggin' smiling potato or an onion, and I just ate its face. Nom. Man, these Japanese are weird. They li apparently like to put the, like tomatoes and the onions and stuff on the, so they, you know, like in certain formations so they look like ducks and pigs and other animals. Whoosh! Off we go! And now we can go outside. Yes! Oh yeah, I have to get drinking things like water and such, which I haven't really collected that much. But who cares? That floating disembodied head can just go and show it. Ah, I'd hate it if somebody just walked into my room right about now and listened to me listening to this music and playing this game. Ooh, sizzle, sizzle. Since that will be really awkward. Just think about it, your mother or your bigger, older brother will just walk into a room when you're playing this game while this music is playing just think how uh, just think about it how awkward that will be yes I recommend that you 
watch the, at least this video with headsets since, well, I, well, I suppose it's too late for you. It's too late for you, run! Come on, where's all this stuff at? Everything is so big! There we go. Now I think I can go get those apple things. Under one minute remaining, and I have to get like 20 centimeters, so oh, joy! Ah! Get some! Quickly! I'm running out of time! Ah! This is bad! This is bad! I don't think I'm gonna make it! If I'm not gonna make it, then it sucks! Because I've gotta do this all over again! Oh, no, I'm gonna make it! Ha! <laughs> Just kidding! What am I saying? Of course, when I say I'm not, I think I'm not gonna make it, I'm gonna get flowers and stuff. Oh, 50 centimeters already? Cut a fast for Prince. Why are you saying that I'm not that good roller? You know, punk? You know, pops? This is the way how I roll, punk. Yeah. Whole body all done. Off we go to the Prince Dom. To the Prince Dom, yes. Rebels! Numb. Nice to see you again. How did rolling go? We do need that military. Hope you managed to get lots of things to drink. Mercury shall be fluid and quick civil. Got us a Katamari to show us? Well, bring it out. This is the Katamari, a mere 56 centimeters and 9 millimeters. Here's what's in there. The top ingredients are snacks. Yes, looks like you might get some stuff. You recall we asked for lots of things to drink. So why are we looking at this shriveled thing? Mm. Is it for a preservation, sun-dried katamari? We are not amused. Now for a bonus bean count. Hmm, well, let's see. Let's see, 16 points. Is this on purpose, not for a documentary? If you don't step up, we'll ask Kunihiro for help instead. A trace of Earnestness, aha, Master Kunihiro. I've packed up and labeled for a trip to the Prince Dom. Yay for a star, Uhuru! Fuck yeah! Hmm, at least it doesn't take up much space. You're a party pooper. Learn to roll better. <laughs> Oh, he's so mean. You are a master of quick turn. Oh, yay. This just in. The Prince Dome is now bigger. Check out the new places. There's a photo album, presents and other things. We also added a totally fab place for you to play. We gave it the best name, the Big Tripper. It takes you on a voyage of light and sound, see? Now you can make new stars again, twinkle, twinkle. Uh, what was the button for print? Oh yeah, X. Swoosh! Wanananananananana. I'm just gonna do this one and just cut it. Welcome to the dazzling Lady La Casino. Roll a winning Kalamari and planet Venice arises. For that we need a lot of expensive items. Well, Venice will be gorgeous, a golden apple of a star. Are we right or are we right? Come on, answer us. Correct, off to Earth now. See you sometime later. Brrrr!
Milky Way, Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Neptune, Pluto, Pluto, oh no, Uranus. Pluto is not even in the our solar system anymore. Or it's not, well it is, but it's not classified as a planet anymore. And ever, all of the other things so, so, so said in the previous loading screen were planet. This is somebody's house. He has a glam wife who's totally sympathetical with us. Oh yes, the Katamari. If you're only this big in this much time, then it's all shiny. Collect expensive items, yes? Yes, you told me already that. That this is not candy corn. I wonder, can I get this thing set? Probably not. Ah, no. Defying physics they are indeed, yes. Oh great, even weirder music. Honestly, how weird can this music get? I have no freaking clue whatsoever. <laughs> oh shit. This music is so fucking weird that it melts my brain. Honestly. It just melts my brain. It's so weird. And there's a dog playing poker. Where is your logic now? And also there's a tiny guy who is rolling up a ball of crap. What is this, freaking English or Japanese? Since she's like speaking English the other second and speaking Japanese the other. Gookaruku! Ah, my god, I shall just mute the music, but heck, I'll just keep it there, for the sake of it, so I can just mock it. Oh well, screw you rats, I'm just gonna roll you up. Oh yeah, I gotta get expensive stuff, like a diamond ring and this brooch. And like, whoever game, came up with the concept of Katamari Damacy must have been high, honestly. Okay, let's make a guy, let's make a game where it's this tiny little guy who's rolling up stuff in Earth with this ball which has a sticky surface on it, and then, uh, uh, and then on the later levels, he will start rolling up humans, and then on the friggin' final levels, he will start rolling up friggin' planets and galaxies. That's the greatest idea ever! That must have been how the conversation went on. And also, let's have weird music, which probably nobody likes, but what the heck. We'll just put it there, since it's weird. Yeah, don't step on me. Oh, I can't take the Dursal bunnies yet. Well, screw you. Screw you, I can live without them. And there's a cat with a top hat. And I just realized how clever the game designers were since that just rhymed again. Damn you game designers and your rhyming skills, why aren't you not rapping yet? There should be a rap in this game since they're so well at rhyming apparently. Yeah! In the hood, yeah! Imagine this game with like 50 cent or some gangsta, gangsta music like that. Just imagine it. Yeah, I'm the hood rolling up your shit doll! Yeah, what you gonna do? Absolutely nothing! Cause I'm a Kamari Demacy, I'm gonna roll up your shit doll! Yeah, that's probably what it will be. Flowers! Oh, 
six to centimeter already. Kind of fast for Prince. Yes, you can roll up almost everything, and holy crap, whoever owns this house is a, it's like the most disorganized person ever. Well, I would imagine that they will be very disorganized if they were like so, if they were so, um, sharp. Just look at her, she's so sharp, her hair, it's like sharp and stuff, it's like a cube. Babies, I roll you up. You are in my ball now, baby. Alrighty, all done. Off we go to Princeton. Shush. No. Now he should not be disappointed in me. I almost got it twice as big as requested. Hello again, Spotternik. Feeling orbital, hmm, Mr. Venus ago? Did you get a lot of expensive things? Venus is an expensive place, you know. Where were you? Oh, that. Give it there. Give it here. And it's one meter, five centimeter, and four millimeters. Congrats. Can we go? Here's what's in there. The top ingredients are games. Yes, looks like you managed to get some stuff. Let's see what that expensive stuff we asked you to get. Um, where do you get this? Dinky and paltry ink. We're not smelling a lot of expensive stuff. Coming from this, though it smell it, though smell it does. We do not like it at all. Now for a bonus bean count. Hmm, well, let's see. Let's see, 69 points. Such an ordinary score. Was that callous? Sorry. It's okay. Normal is back in vogue. It's the new black. Yay for a star, Uhuru. Boom! Yeah, I'm a friggin' planet. That was barely worth it. Here's an idea. You can do better. Before I disown you, punk. <laughs>